Hey guys, it's Azurblade again, and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Fire Red. Last time, we went through Viridian Forest and made our way to Pewter City. This time, we're gonna go to the Pokemart first, because I want to see if they've got any new items in stock. And they do! They have an Awakening and a Escape Rope down here. You better have Burn Heal and some Repels. I'm gonna buy one single repel. Uh, sh sh no, I'll buy an awakening and one potion. That should be enough. All right, now that I've got that, now we want to head up to the gym up here. Walk this way. And here we have the Museum of Science. I'm not going in there because, well, there's not a whole lot to really look at. What do you gotta say? Clefairy came from the moon. That Clefairy came from the moon? At least that's what it says. Pewter City Pokemon Gym, Leader Brock, the rock solid Pokemon trainer. All right. Now before I go any further, this is my team. Oh, good thing I checked. I want Enma out in front. What do you gotta say? Hiya! Do you want to dream big? Do you dare to become... Do you... Let me try that again. Do you dare to dream of becoming the Pokemon Champion? I'm no trainer, but I can advise you on how to win. Let me take you to the top. No! It's a free service! I'm gonna explain it anyway! Because I won't take no for an answer. The first Pokemon out in the match is at the top left of the Pokemon list. By changing the order of Pokemon, you may gain an advantage. Try different orders to suit your po opponent's party. Whatever. What are you... Trainers! Stop right there, kid! You're 10,000 light years away from facing Brock! That's distance, not time, you idiot. Camper Liam, you... Frickin... Light years! Really? Come on. At least say you're 10,000 years too early, not light years. Ugh. That don't make no damn sense. Gonna have a Geodude. It's rock type. Fight types are very effective against said rock type, so Enma's gonna be out in front and getting some good XP in this gym. And since it's a rock type, no doubt it's pretty heavy, so Low Kick is doing very good. Ooh, level 9. Ooh, level... 20 attack. Sweet. Next up is Sandshrew, which is a ground type. And it's not gonna do as much damage here. Yeah, that hardly did anything. Alright. Leonardo, you're up. Go, Leonardo! Oh, defense curl. You're gonna try and turtle. Well, too bad for you. I am Elemental Hero Bubble Man! Use Bubble! Attack his life points directly! It's super effective. Freaking. Attack his life points directly. This isn't Yu Gi Oh! I probably made this joke last episode, but I don't remember. I was half asleep when I recorded it, to be truthful with you all. Okay, enough about that. One more bubble should do the trick and take the sand shroom down. No problem. Yeah, he's dead! Enma did not level up, but Leonardo did. Level 12. Sweet. Good job, Leonardo. Darn! Light years is a time, it measures distance. Then why did you make the comparison? Absolute doof. Okay. So you're here. I'm Brock. I'm Pewter's, Pewter's gym leader. I don't know why I'm talking like this, but my rock hard willpower is evident even in my Pokemon. My Pokemon are all rock hard and have true grit determination. That's right. My Pokemon are all the rock type. <laughs> you're going to challenge me knowing that you'll lose? That's the trainer's honor that compels you to challenge me! For the love of God, stop talking and get on with the fight because this voice is killing me! Whew. 
Alright, leader Brock. He starts off with a level 12 Geodude. Just gonna glow kick your face into oblivion. Don't mind me. Whew, that voice hurt my throat so badly. I need to take a drink of water for that one. So how's everyone doing today? Uh, it's currently 11 o'clock at night when I'm recording this. Got no, nothing better to do. Not that that's really important to talk about in a Let's Play, but... Eh, it's just something neat to do. But yeah, I'm doing alright. Wow, that nearly killed me. Scratch the rock! Doesn't matter that it's not very effective, it's just weak enough to where it wouldn't matter. And Enma's level 10 now! Three attack from that one level. You're gonna be a heavy hitter later on in the game. Brock's second and last Pokemon is a level 14 Onyx. I'm gonna switch back to Leonardo. No, I will not switch to Pikachu and have an electric attack magically work. It's not how that works. You lowered my speed. Wonderful. Okay. Gonna use Bubble. That'll do a lot of damage, I hope. Uh, that's pretty effective. Okay. I got this in the bag. Nice try, Brock. And it's a pointless critical. Lovely. Good job, Leonardo. And you too, Enma. Level 11. Ooh, he learned Karate Chop. That's awesome. It's a very strong attack for this point in the game. Oh god, here we go again. <clears throat> I took you for granted and so I lost. As proof of your victory, I confer on you this. The official Pokemon League Boulder Badge. This is the only time you'll ever see this during a gym fight like this, so enjoy it. Just having the Boulder Badge makes your Pokemon more powerful. It also enables the use of the move Flash outside of battle. Of course, the Pokemon must know, th know the move Flash to use it. Oh, that voice is a killer on my throat. Wait, take this with you. Stop talking! Please! A TM Tentacle Machine contains a technique for Pokemon. Using a TM teaches the move it contains to a Pokemon. A TM is good for only one use. This is a Generation 5. So when you only use one, pick the Pokemon carefully. Anyway, TM39 contains Rock Tomb. It hurls boulders at the bow and, the bow and lowers its speed. Oh, thank God he's done talking. I need another drink of water after that. Oh, God. <sighs> that was awful. Why did I do that? Now that you're done with that ridiculous insanity, now you want to head east. Out of Pewter City. Wait, did I heal first? Nope, I should probably go do that real quick. Alright, now that you're done healing, now you want to head east. And if you head over east, then you see this guy with the glasses. Oh, Red! I'm glad I caught up to you! I'm Professor Oak's aide. I don't have a name, but I've been asked to deliver this, so here you go. Hooray, the running shoes. Press the B button to run, but only when there's room to run. Well, I bet I must be going back to the lab. Bye-bye. There's a letter attached. Dear Red, here's a pair of running shoes from my beloved challenger. Just cheer for you, don't give up. Aw, that's nice. Well, before I continue on, I'm gonna bring Pikachu out to the... Actually, hmm. No, I'll bring Leonardo out to the... I'm confused! I'll bring Pikachu out to the front because Pikachu... She's not gonna get much use after this little area here. Excuse me, you looked at me, didn't you? I'm not even looking at you. Last Janice. Got a Pidgey. I'm gonna knock this thing out with a Thundershock. Pikachu, use Thundershock! Wow, that did 
Oh, it got paralyzed. Sweet. There's a million things you could have chose to do in that moment, yet you decided with sand attack. Really? Really? Sand attack? Come on. Alright. Next Pidgey. Level 9 as well. Same as the- Hey! Freaking sand attack! Okay, please- COME ON! You're just gonna continue to use sand attack, aren't you? Please hit! Thank you! Alright. No, critical hit! Good job, Pikachu. You did good. And you're level 10 now. Nice. Just barely. You're mean! Well, you're throwing sand at my face, so as far as I'm concerned, you're mean. You shouldn't be staring if you don't want to put- I WASN'T EVEN LOOKING AT YOU THOUGH! Uh, Nintendo Logic! Hey, I saw you in Viridian Forest. Well, I mean, you look the same as all the other bug trainers. What's your name? Colton. No, I didn't see you in Viridian Forest. Okay, hit you with the Thundershock. Let's see how much this does. Not as much as I was hoping, to be honest. Uh, let's try it again. Maybe this will be, be enough. Nope, not quite. One more should suffice, though. Yeah, he's dead. What do you got next? Weedle. All right. Use the same thing, just another thunder shock. Ooh, that did half damage. And I'm poisoned. Lovely. Somehow knew in the back of my mind before that hit me. It's like, oh, poison sting. I'm gonna get poisoned. And, well, I got poisoned. Just lovely. Another Caterpie. Come on, Pikachu. You got this. You're level 10 Caterpie. Why do you not evolve your Pokemon? If you evolved all three of these, they would be Butterfreeze and Beedrill. You'd actually be a very dangerous trainer if you evolved these three. But the fact that you didn't, you suck. Now, go down already. Really? Come on. Can extend this battle more than it needs to be. Yeah, yeah, hurt by the poison. Blah, 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 blah. Why were you faster than me? Oh, right, he lowered my speed. Probably should pay attention to that. At least it didn't knock out Pikachu. And you leveled up. You're level 11 now. Sweet. Quick attack. Yes, please. I'm gonna get rid of Growl for that. Because, honestly, I don't really need a... I don't really need Pikachu to lower your attack. You beat me again! I never met you! Okay. Go to my bag and... Do I have an antidote? Yes, I do. Here you go, Pikachu. And... You know what? I'm going to the Pokemon Center. I'm not going to use my one and only potion. Alright, now that I've done... Healing my po Pokemon, and by Pokemon, I mean Pikachu, because he's the only one that got damaged. Let's continue through here. Hi! I like shorts! They're delightfully comfy and easy to wear! Good for you! I don't know why you need to tell me that your shorts are delightfully comfy to wear, but you do you, man. That battle was so boring, it wasn't even worth showing. So, I'm gonna heal Pikachu, because he took a bit of a beating that fight. Got another bug catcher here, what are you gonna say? Trainer, let's get on with it right away. Okay, bug catcher, um... Greg? Let's see what you got, Greg. Wow! 
poor Greg. He's like, go get him, Weedle! Alright, Greg. I'm gonna use Poison Sting and String Shot on that Pikachu. And it's gonna go well. Oh my god, such a shock! <laughs> poor guy. Uh, that was actually kind of funny. I love getting these critical hits. And Pikachu's level 12 now. Sweet. Kakuna, okay. I'm sure you're gonna be like every other Kakuna and just try to turtle with Harden. Too bad for you. Thundershock is a special attack, so you are using Harden for nothing. Yay, it's gone! And I've got more XP. Metapod, you're gonna do the same thing. All you're doing is wasting my time. But by all means, keep doing that. It just means more XP for me. Metapod's defense rose, blah 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 blah. Thundershock, and that should be enough. There it is. Sweet. Goodbye, Greg. If I had new Pokemon, I would have won. Or how about you actually train them worth a damn? Hmm, let's fight you. Hey, you're not wearing shorts! What's wrong with you? Um, not a shorts person? Have you thought about that, Calvin? I got a Spiro, huh? I thought about using a Spiro at one point when making this project, but I decided against it. Because, I mean, Spiro's great and everything. Everything. What was that accent there? Everything. Every. <sighs> Critical hit again. <laughs> Poor Spiro. But yeah, Spiro's great and all, but. Nah. Every playthrough of this game I've ever seen always uses Spiro, so I thought I'll use something else, and I decided on Mankey. Let's head up here, get into another fight. That look you gave me, it's so intriguing. Okay. Alright, several attacks later, Nidoran is finally down. That took forever. So, I'm not gonna show that whole battle, because that was not fun to watch. Water gun, huh? Okay. Bubble has 20 power, and water gun has 40. Gee, I wonder which one I'm going to use. You forgot Bubble and learned Water Gun. That's going to be very helpful. Be nice. Okay, I'm sorry. You can avoid battles by not letting trainers see you. Okay. Well, I can't avoid this one. I'll battle you with the Pokemon I just caught! Okay, I'm sure they're just going to be crappy bug types, right? Got another Caterpie that isn't evolved for some reason. Alright, Pikachu, you got this. Okay, please survive. Good. Good, Pikachu. One more Thundershock to Caterpie, and it is down, ladies and gentlemen. Pikachu has beaten the Caterpie. Will Metapod fare any better? Probably not, because all it does is use Harden. It's a one-trick pony, or pod in this case. Use another Thundershock and bring it down. It is down, ladies and gentlemen! And Pikachu is just shy of another level. Done like dinner. Mm-hmm. Trained Pokemon are stronger than the wild ones. Yes, they are. Eek! Did you touch me? Nope. Level 14 Jigglypuff. This might be a problem. I'm gonna use Thunder Wave for a change so I can get a guaranteed paralysis. And Pikachu's finally down. Alright, Enma, you're up. Jigglypuff is a bit tanky, so I'm gonna use Leer and lower its defense. 
You son of a gun. It's gonna be like that, huh? Well, you know what? I bet you won't do it twice in a row. Let's see. Ha! You're paralyzed. I'm gonna le leer at you one more time. Hopefully you won't use defense curl. Okay, good. That did a lot of damage. Use karate chop. Let's see how much that does. Thank you! I was hoping that one shot Jigglypuff because it has a very annoying move. Well, not move. It has an ability that makes your the Pokemon infatuated, which is... It makes it a lot harder to attack than it needs to be. Any items here? Nope. Don't look like it. I'm gonna skip you and go heal up here, and then I'll be back down to battle you real quick. But now that we're in this Pokemon Center, we want to talk to this man up here. Hello there, laddie! Have I got a deal just for you! I'll let you have a secret Pokemon, a Magikarp, for just $500! So you'll buy it, am I right? This is a terrible deal, because I already have a water type, and Magikarp will only know Splash! I mean, it evolves into an awesome Pokemon later on, but again, I already have a water type, so this trade for me, or this buy is entirely pointless for me, so I'm not gonna bother. Let's see what you've got to say. Oh, you're not even a trainer. Well, this is awkward. Well, you know what? I'm gonna see if I can find any wild Pokemon here while I end the episode. Got a Spearow here, so... Yeah, that's gonna be it for today's episode of Let's Play Pokemon Fire Red. If you liked the video, leave a comment and a like. But if you hated the video, then leave a hate comment on how much I suck and dislike the video and pretty much forget I ever exist. See you guys next time. WHAT?! He needs 1 XP?! Are you kidding me?! Ugh. <laughs> Bye, guys. Sorry the blowing out the eardrums, but that's annoying.